today I was uh, very pleased uh, to see uh, and meet uh, His Excellency, uh, Prime Minister of the Republic of Timor-Leste. Uh, and I, my main objective was uh, to inform uh, His Excellency of the upcoming visit uh, of the Assistant Secretary General, uh, the, Pre the Director of the Asia Pacific Bureau of the United Nations uh, Development Program, Ms. Kanye Vinaraja. Uh, she will be arriving in Timor-Leste on the 17th of October, and she will spend uh, five days visiting the country and uh, communities and the government. So she will begin her visit uh, with the meeting of uh, His Excellency Prime Minister. And uh, we will be talking about the main uh, development objectives of uh, UNDP. Uh, UNDP has been in the country for the past uh, 20 plus years, and uh, we have been supporting three main pillars of development. The first one is uh, economic development and poverty reduction. The second one is uh, governance and institutional building. And the third one is uh, environment and uh, climate change resilience. So these were the three main objectives uh, that uh, we have discussed today, uh, together with His Excellency Prime Minister of the Republic. Yes, uh, so besides the information about the upcoming visit and uh, preparation, uh, we discussed uh, what type of support uh, UNDP has provided to the country in the past uh, five years, especially during very challenging years about you know, COVID recovery, you know, uh, floods, uh, recovery, and so on. So I pointed out uh, that uh, we have uh, had some very important uh, uh, projects uh, which relieved communities uh, from uh, after the floods. So for example, we ran a uh, cash for work uh, program uh, in 50 aldeas uh, around Dili, which were inundated uh, by the floods. Uh, and this uh, really helped uh, communities recover and uh, rebuild their uh, infrastructure uh, after the, you know, the floods. So we, I also informed uh, His Excellency that uh, UNDP has been uh, providing and initiating uh, support to small and medium enterprises. For example, together with uh, BNCTL and MTCI, we started a uh, soft loan program of 3% for the entrepreneurs. Now, uh, this small program has uh, gotten a uh, support, financial support from the government of up to $50 million. And I'm very happy that uh, support to youth and, and enterprises is becoming uh, one of the main priorities of the government. And finally, I also informed and asked advice from uh, Prime Minister about uh, how can we continue working to reduce poverty and reduce malnutrition in the countries, which are main two challenges that uh, His Excellency Prime Minister has mentioned. And uh, my point was that uh, in, in order to reduce poverty, we have to work directly with the communities and uh, create conditions of jobs, but also create conditions for local production, uh, for example, of local production of uh, rice and essential products that Timorese consume. And we have some uh, success stories for example, from Okusi, where we have directly worked with farmers to increase uh, local production of uh, essential uh, uh, pr consum consumption items, such as rice, vegetables, and so on.